So let's hear it for Ms. Don Rattuli. Come here, dear. Get close to it. That's fine, right there. Can you hear him? Say something. Checking. Checking. Say checking. Checking. There you go. <laughs> this is a story I want to tell you about the BC problem. A newly married couple was looking for a home in the country. After finding a place, they rented it and moved in to it to make it their home. After moving in, the young couple noticed that the bathroom did not have a commode, so she decided to write the owner. But being very bashful, she hesitated. She did not want to spell out bathroom commode, so she just put the initials BC. So uh, this is uh, every time uh, uh, they say uh, say something uh, for. Uh, bathroom commode, the uh, man says, Baptist Church. <laughs> so this is the answer uh, they give the, the young couple about the uh, Baptist Church, and she's thinking the bathroom commode. I regret very much the delay in answering your recent letter, but now I take great pleasure in informing you that there is a nice BC just five miles down the road, <laughs> east of you that will seat 250 people. <laughs> this five miles distance is a little bit unfortunate if you are in the habit of going regularly. <laughs> but no doubt you will be interested to know that many people just take their lunch and make a day of it. <laughs> They usually arrive early and stay late for fun and fellowship. The last time my wife and I went was years ago and we were just a little bit late and had to stand up. <laughs> it may interest you to know that a box supper is being held to raise the funds to buy plush seats in the BC. <laughs> I think this would be a nice be nice for a person who likes to sit in comfort while he meditates. <laughs> a very friendly usher always greets you at the door upon arrival and takes you to a seat. Many years ago, my wife and I lived in the house you are renting and we attended the BC. The men and women did not sit together then, but, but, but now in these modern times, everybody comes in and sits together as they choose. <laughs> I know that many people resolve to attend to be seen more often, but when the time has come, they just lie in bed and read the paper until they find out that it's too late to go. <laughs> I'd like to add that it pains me very much not to be able to attend to be seen more often myself, but it is surely not for the lack of desire on my part. As you grow older, it seems to be more of an effort, particularly in cold weather. In conclusion, we hope to see you there soon. Sincerely. And that's the end of the BC problem. Doesn't my wife have a beautiful voice? <laughs> No, so I never sing a song, you know that. But I figured the only way to get your attention was to tell you she was going to sing a song. 